Now, what do we have here? Brand new diesel heater. This is a game changer. <laughs> it's Chinese. Uh, okay, so the reservoir is built into it. 12 volt connections are just very basic. Uh, interesting indeed. Now it's got some clips on it here. Yeah, so I took the case off, and this is what we're left with. This is the actual heater here. You see your wiring for your controls. And then this is a fuel reservoir, and you've got the fuel line right here. Um, I'll have to test to see how long it'll run on this. I may end up doing a supplemental fuel tank, but for now, this will get me through the winter. Okay, so it's upside down. I don't have any of the clamps on but got all the hoses affixed to it just to see how everything kind of goes together that's very simple very very simple i mean it's almost self-explanatory i haven't really even had to look at the instructions yet but don't worry i will <laughs> and another cool thing is there is a remote to operate it which is cool and it's got this little slide Hey man, it's just now starting to uh, ignite. It took about a minute and a half to prime and everything. Uh, okay, still not warm yet. That clicking is something. <laughs> no, when you first fire it up, this uh, aluminum exhaust, it will smoke, it's just burning off that factory residue. Uh, there's some kind of cloth material and a spring inside of there. That's all that muffler is. Um, so just be mindful of that. I was a little scared at first there was smoke coming off, but that was just the new pipe. I would recommend upgrading this pipe though, because I've already found it's got some pinhole leaks in here, and that's from the factory. She ran for 15 minutes. I used the remote, just held down the off button. Uh, she spun down. Of course, fan is still blowing uh, to help disperse the heat that's in there. Kind of wondering how long it's gonna run like this until it shuts down. But anyway, this sucker is putting out a great amount of heat. I mean, it feels like it's like 200 degrees. Uh, so this will be more than sufficient. I mean, if I wanted to, I could run duct work all through this van. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna wrap it up. This is it, highly recommend. This is a Chinese made Wit Pro. Uh, have a good day. We got the uh, wood install coming soon after Christmas.